സെക്കൻഡ് സെമസ്റ്റർ ബി എസ് സി കോംപ്ലിമെൻ്ററി മാത്തമാറ്റിക്സിലെ തേർഡ് മോഡ്യൂളിലെ ഡിറ്റേമിനൻസ് എന്ന ഒരു സെക്ഷനാണ് ഞാൻ ഇന്ന് ഇവിടെ ഈ വീഡിയോ ക്ലാസ്സിൽ പ്രസൻ്റ് ചെയ്യുന്നത് ഫസ്റ്റ് ഐ ഡിഫൈൻ എ മെട്രിക്സ് എ മെട്രിക്സ് ഈസ് എ റെക്റ്റാംഗുലർ അറേ ഓഫ് നമ്പേഴ്സ് അറേഞ്ച്ഡ് ഇൻ ടു റോസ് ആൻഡ് കോളംസ് ഫോർ എക്സാമ്പിൾ എ ഇസ് ഈക്വൽ ടു വൺ ടു മൈനസ് വൺ ത്രീ മൈനസ് ത്രീ ഫോർ ഫൈവ് മൈനസ് ടു സിക്സ് മൈനസ് ഫൈവ് വൺ സെവൻ ദിസ് ഈസ് എ മെട്രിക്സ് ഇറ്റ് ഈസ് എ റെക്റ്റാംഗുലർ അറേ ഓഫ് നമ്പേഴ്സ് അറേഞ്ച്ഡ് ഇൻ ടു റോസ് ആൻഡ് കോളംസ് ഹിയർ ദർ ആർ ത്രീ റോസ് ദിസ് ഈസ് ദ ഫസ്റ്റ് റോ ആൻഡ് ദിസ് ഈസ് ദ സെക്കൻഡ് റോ ആൻഡ് ദിസ് ഈസ് ദ തേർഡ് റോ ആൻഡ് ദിസ് മെട്രിക്സ് ഹാസ് ഫോർ കോളംസ് ദിസ് ഈസ് ദ ഫസ്റ്റ് കോളം ദിസ് ഈസ് ദ സെക്കൻഡ് കോളം ദിസ് ഈസ് ദ തേർഡ് കോളം ആൻഡ് ദിസ് ഈസ് ദ ഫോർത്ത് കോളം If a matrix has m rows and n columns then then we say the matrix is of order m by n this read as m by n matrix has m rows and n columns order of the matrix is m by n the general form of a m by n matrix is a is equal to this a11 a12 etc a1j etc a1n a21 a22 etc a2j etc a2n etc am1 am2 etc a m j etc am a i1 a i2 a i j etc a i n this is the general form of a m by n matrix it has m rows and n columns one row two row i row m row this first column second column this j th column this is the n th column <coughs> now this element a ij this i means the row in which the element occur and j means the column in which the element occur so a ij occur in the ith row and jth column this ij is called the address of the element <coughs> now if the number of rows is equal to the number of columns in a matrix then that matrix is called a a square matrix number of rows is equal to number of columns if number of rows equal to number of columns is equal to n then the square matrix is square matrix is of order n by n and order m by n n by n we simply denote it by order n now uh, we define a quantity called determinants for square matrices first for a square matrix of order 1 a is equal to a determinant of this square matrix is determinant a this reads as determinant a c is equal to determinant a This is the notation. This is equal to 
a so determinant of a square matrix of order 1 determinant a is equal to determinant a is equal to a now for a square matrix of order 2 a is equal to a1 a2 b1 b2 determinant of this square matrix is determinant a is equal to determinant of a1 a2 b1 b2 this is equal to this is equal to a1 into b2 so multiply these two diagonal elements this is a1 into b2 minus a2 into b1 multiply these two diagonal elements a1 into b2 minus multiply these two diagonal elements a2 into b1 this is determinant of a square matrix of order 2 now for a, a square matrix of order 3 a is equal to this a1 a2 a3 b1 b2 b3 c1 c2 c3 determinant of a is equal to determinant of a1 a2 a3 b1 b2 b3 c1 c2 c3 this is equal to a1 into take a1 a1 into now cancel the row and the column containing a1 cancel the first row and the first column this is the row and the column containing a1 then determinant of the remaining matrix b2 b3 c2 c3 minus a2 into a2 into now cancel the row and the column containing a a2 the first row and the second column determinant of the remaining matrix b1 b3 c1 c3 plus a3 into cancel the row and the column containing a3 the first row and the third column cancel determinant of the remaining matrix b1 b2 c1 c2 so this is equal to <coughs> this is equal to a1 into b2 c3 minus b3 c2 minus a2 into b1 c3 minus b3 c1 plus a3 into b1 c2 minus b2 this is the determinant of the square matrix of order 3 so we have defined determinants for square matrix of order 1 order 2 and order 3 <laughs> Example, consider matrix A is equal to the matrix 5. Determinant A is equal to determinant of 5 is equal to 5. <laughs> consider A is equal to 1, 2, 3, minus 1. Determinant of A is equal to determinant of 1, 2, 3, minus 1. This is equal to 1 into minus 1 minus 3 into 2. This is equal to minus 1 minus 6. This is equal to minus. Consider A is equal to 1 minus 1 2 3 1 2 
4 4 minus 2 5 determinant of a is equal to 1 into determinant of 1 2 minus 2 5 minus minus 1 into determinant of 3 2 4 5 plus 2 into determinant of 3 1 4 minus 2 this is equal to 1 into this 1 into 5 minus minus 2 into 2 5 plus 4 plus 1 into 15 minus 8 plus 2 into minus 6 minus 4 is equal to 9 plus 7 minus 20 this is equal to minus 4 so determinant of this a matrix is minus 4 now uh, I define the minus and cofactors of elements of a square matrix <coughs> the minor of an element aij of a square matrix minor of aij it is denoted by mij it is the determinant of the matrix obtained by deleting the ith row and jth column the row and column containing the element aij we delete the row and column containing element aij that is the ith row and jth column the determinant of the remaining matrix that is denoted by mij and is called the minor of the element aij and and cofactor of the element aij It is denoted by Cij. It is called the signed minor. Signed minor of A. That is, it is minus 1 raised to i plus j of Mij. This is cofactor of the element Aij. <coughs> now, we can find a determinant of a matrix using cofactors. Uh, for example, we have given a 3 by 3 matrix. a is equal to a11, a12, a13, a21, a22, a23, a31, a32, a33. We can we can find the determinant of this matrix using cofactors in six ways. <coughs> first, uh, we take the first row, the first row of this matrix and its cofactors. Then, determinant A is equal to a11 into its cofactor c11 plus a12 into its cofactor c12 plus a13 into its cofactor c13. <coughs> Similarly, we can find determinant of this matrix using second row. Determinant A is equal to a21 into its cofactor c21 plus a22 into its cofactor c22 plus a23 into its cofactor c23 similarly we can find determinant using the third row 
a three one into is square factor c three one plus a three two into square factor c c three two plus a three three into square factor c three three. Similarly, using columns, we can find determinant. Using first column, determinant of a is equal to a one one into its cofactor c one one plus a two one into its cofactor c two one plus a three one into its cofactor c three one. Similarly, using uh, second column, determinant a is equal to a one two into its cofactor c one two plus a two two into its cofactor c two two plus a three two into its cofactor c three two. Similarly, we can find determinant of this matrix using the third column. A one three into c one three plus a two three into c two three plus a three three into c three three. So we can find determinant of this matrix using six ways using cofactors. <coughs> so uh, determinants uh, of larger order, for example, determinant of order four, uh, etc., can also be found using this method using a row a row of the matrix and its cofactors. Multiply them, add them. Similarly. A column of the matrix and its cofactors. Multiply them, add them. Consider the matrix A is equal to two, four, seven, six, zero, three, one, five, three. We find the determinant of this matrix using the first row and its cofactors. So this is uh, the determinant that we defined earlier. <coughs> Minor of two. This is, this is the element a one one. A one one is equal to two. Minor of two is m one one. It is determinant of The matrix obtained by deleting the row and the column containing two. That is this determinant of zero, three, five, three. This is equal to zero into three, zero minus fifteen. This is equal to minus fifteen. Cofactor of this element. It is. We denote it by C11. It is equal to minus one raised to add these two suffixes, one plus one into M11. It is minus one square into minus fifteen. C is equal to minus fifteen. Now A12 is equal to four. This is first row, second column. That element. It's minor. M12 is equal to determinant of the matrix obtained by deleting this element A1 to 4. Delete the first row and the second column. Remaining matrix 6, 3, 1, 3. 6 is equal to 18 minus 3. It is equal to 15. A13 is equal to A13 is equal to 7. Its minor is M13 is equal to determinant of the matrix obtained by deleting the row and column containing 7. It is determinant uh, determinant 6015. C is equal to thirty minus zero. It is equal to thirty. Cofactor of this element C one three is equal to minus one raised to one plus three into m one three. C is equal to minus one raised to four into into thirty. It is equal to thirty. 
Now, uh, 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 I have not found the cofactor of this. Uh, so, cofactor of this element A12 is equal to 4. It is C12 is equal to minus 1 raised to 1 plus 2 into, into M12. It is minus 1 cube into 15. It is minus 1 into 15. It is minus 15. So, determinant of this matrix using first row and its cofactors is determinant A is equal to 2 into its cofactor is minus 15 plus 4 into its cofactor is minus 15 plus 7 into this 7 into its cofactor is 30 is equal to minus 30 minus 60 plus 2 ton is equal to 2 ton minus 90 it is 120 so this is the determinant of this matrix using the first row and its cofactors. <coughs> now uh, I find the determinant of this matrix using uh, some other row. For example, third row and its cofactors. The uh, third consider the third row uh, a three one. This is equal to one. So it's a minor m31. This is equal to determinant of. So delete the row and the column containing this one. Delete third row and first column. Determinant of the remaining matrix. It is four seven zero three. It is twelve minus zero is equal to twelve. Cofactor of this element. C31 it is minus 1 raised to 3 plus 1 into M31. It is minus 1 raised to 4 into M31 is equal to 12. It is 1 into 12 C is equal to 12. Now consider the element A32. This is the element in third row and second column. A32 a32 is equal to 5 its its minor is m32 is m32 is equal to determinant of so cancel the row and column containing this element a32 third row delete second column delete remaining matrix 2673 2, 6, 7, 3. It is 2 into 3. It is 6 minus 42. It is minus 36. <coughs> Cofactor of this element A32 is equal to 5. C32 is equal to minus 1 raised to 3 plus 2 into M32. It is minus 1 raised to 5 into minus 36. It is minus 1 into minus 36 C is equal to 36. Now consider uh, the last element in the third row. This is A33. A3, A33 is equal to 3. It is minor. M33 is equal to. Cancel the row and column containing this 3. So the remaining matrix is 2, 4, 6, 0. 2, 4, 6, 0. It's equal to 0 minus 24. This is equal to minus 24. 
cofactor is cofactor of this element is c33 is equal to minus 1 raised to 3 plus 3 into m33 it is equal to minus 1 raised to 6 into minus 24 this 1 into minus 24 is equal to minus 24 now uh, finding the determinant to uh, multiply the third row and its cofactors add them so 1 into determinant a is equal to 1 into its cofactor is 12 plus 5 into its cofactor is 36 plus 3 into its cofactor is minus 24 is equal to 12 plus 180 minus 72 12 plus 180 minus this is equal to 192 192 minus 72 is 120 so we get the same determinant 120 <coughs> similarly you, we can find a determinant using second row and its cofactors now uh, i find uh, the determinant of this matrix using a column and its cofactors for example i take the second column 4 0 5 This is a, a12. See, in the first row, second column, a12 is equal to 4. It's minor, m12 is equal to determinant of. So, delete the row and the column containing this 4. 6, 3, 1, 3. It's equal to 18 minus 3. 6 into 3 minus 1 into 3. It's equal to 15. Cofactor. C12 is equal to minus 1 raised to 1 plus 2 into M12. It is minus 1 cube into 15 is equal to minus 15. Next element in the second column is this is A22 is equal to second row, second column. It is equal to 0. It is minor M22 is equal to determinant of so delete the second row and second column 2 7 2 7 1 3 is equal to 6 minus 7 it is equal to minus 1 so <coughs> cofactor is c22 is equal to minus 1 raised to 2 plus 2 into m22 it is equal to minus 1 raised to 4 into minus 1. It is equal to 1 into minus 1. It is equal to minus 1. Now, the third element in the second column is 5. It is A32. It is equal to 5. Element in the third row and second column. Minor is M32 is equal to determinant of uh, delete the third row and second column. 2, 6, 7, 3. 2, 6, 7, 3. It is 2 into 3 minus 6 into 7. It is 6 minus 42 is equal to minus, minus 36. Cofactor is C32 is equal to minus 1 raised to 3 plus 2 into into m32 into minus 36 minus 1 raised to 5 into minus 36 it is minus 1 into minus 36 equal to 36 so determinant of this matrix using the second column is 4 into determinant a is equal to 4 into its cofactor minus 15 plus Next element is 0. 0 into its cofactor is 
its cofactor is minus 1. Third element is 5. 5 into its cofactor is 36. It's equal to minus 60 plus 0. It is 180. 180 minus 60 is 1. So we get the same answer 120. When uh, finding a determinant, uh, we uh, the most simple way is use the row or column with the <coughs> most number of zeros. In this case, we can choose uh, the second column or second row. It has one row. So this e zero is minor row cofactor. Can we do that? No. That multiple zero is minus zero. I put. So then, so we <coughs> choose the row or column with the most number of zeros then uh, we there is no need to find its minor or cofactor because if you multiply uh, that term becomes zero so uh, for uh, larger matrices to find the determinant we use the row or column with most number of zeros it bole baaki ulla column gal ubhayichittum namukku vaanengile Determinant gana. Now, we have to matrix in the determinant gana. Now, we have to define the determinant. We have to first row of the 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 square matrix of order 4 by 4 or square matrix of order 4 a is equal to matrix 5 1 2 4 minus 1 0 2 3 1 1 6 1 1 0 0 minus 4 This is the order 4 in square matrix determinant What do you think? The determinant is the same as the determinant The determinant is the same as the determinant The determinant is the same as the determinant we can choose the fourth row. Fourth row is the zero. If we have zero, we have a cofactor. Because if we multiply this zero by its cofactor, it becomes zero. So we use, uh, we use the fourth row to find the determinant of this matrix. Here, this element is A41. This is element in the fourth row first column a41 is equal to 1 so its minor is m11 is equal to this determinant of delete the row and column containing this word the first column and the fourth row we delete remaining matrix 1 2, 4, 0, 2, 3, 1, 6, 1. Now <coughs> expand this determinant uh, as set earlier for 3 by 3 matrices. So you get <coughs> this, this M41, M41. On expanding this is equal to 1 into this 2 minus 18 minus 2 into 0 minus 3 plus 4 into 0 minus 2 is equal to minus 16 plus 6 minus 8. It is minus 18. Cofactor of this element is C41 is equal to 
minus 1 raised to 4 plus 1 into this minor minus 18 it is minus 1 raised to 5 into minus 18 it is minus 1 into minus 18 this is equal to 18 so this is the cofactor of this element 1 now we find the cofactor of this element minus 4 this element is a 4 4 this in the fourth row fourth column minus 4 its minor is m 4 4 determinant of delete the row and the column containing this minus 4 so delete fourth row fourth column determinant of 5 1 2 minus 1 0 2 1 1 6 it is 5 into 0 minus 2 minus 1 into it is minus 6 minus 2 plus 2 into minus 1 minus 0 it is minus 10 plus 8 minus 2 it is minus 12 plus 8 it is minus 4 cofactor is cofactor of this element minus 4 is c 4 4 it is minus 1 raised to 4 plus 4 into this minor minus 4 it is minus 1 raised to 8 into minus 4 this is equal to minus 4 <coughs> Now, determinant of uh, this matrix using the fourth row is this F1 into A41, 1 into its cofactor 18 plus next is 0, next is 0 plus A44 minus 4 into its cofactor is minus 4 is equal to 18 plus 16. 18 plus 16 this is equal to 34 this is the <coughs> determinant of this square matrix of order 4 we uh, find it using the fourth row it is the uh, using the fourth row it is easy to find the determinant.